This is my cat, Bradley. We got him for Christmas in 2013, and he has been a great addition to our family. He is sometimes loving, but sometimes he can be kind of mean. We are glad that he, we got him and love him very much. Here's what some other family members had to say about him. First, let's talk to my sister, Anna. So Eddie and I got Bradley Christmas when I was in seventh grade. And he's been a little crazy boy ever since. He was a super sweet as a baby and now he gets a little sassy sometimes. Um, all my friends love seeing him. He's a, he's a little exciting one. Um, he's been an awesome addition to the family. It's still nice to have a pet around after Dublin died. And he's, a, he's getting nicer. See, he's staying, hanging out with us. Um, we've had some really fun, silly times with Bradley. Eddie and I one time got him to eat part of a Pop-Tart. He did it willingly, don't worry. <laughs> um, he's been super sweet and cuddly sometimes, and he always likes to hang out with you <laughs> when you <laughs> least want him to, as he's a cat. Um, but he's, he's a cutie pie, and he's great to have around. It has knocked down a few Christmas trees ever since we got him for Christmas. He likes to climb up them um, and break all of our ornaments, but that is okay. Right, because he's a cutie. Okay. So uh, you've asked me to talk a little bit about Bradley and how he has affected our lives. And so uh, I was allergic to cats and apparently that allergy wore off. So that when that happened, we were able to get a cat and we always thought that our kids would like a cat and it would be fun to have one. So we got Bradley actually uh, on Christmas morning back uh, a number of years ago. So how has he been, how has he affected our lives? Like many cats, um, he's kind of more of a, of a, a roommate than a pet, right? So he, he definitely does things on his terms. Um, he, he'll wake us up in the morning when he wants to be fed. And sometimes, sometimes we don't, you know, really like that. It's, uh, <laughs> it's a little too early for our taste, but nevertheless, he's, he clearly knows uh, that he wants to be boss. And so he, he, he will let us know that he's ready to eat when, you know, it's time for all that stuff to happen. Um, he has been a good, you know, he can be a, an affectionate animal. Um, and will, and his presence with us is very nice. It's, it's comforting. It's, um, you know, he'll, he'll come and sit beside you if you're watching television or uh, whatever you're doing. One of the funniest things about Bradley and that I have found pretty endearing is that anything you put on the ground, be it a suitcase that happens to be left open or a bag or a towel or a jacket or anything like that, he eventually has to investigate it and make it his own. So he'll be in it or on it or asleep on it and clearly decides that it's his. Experts say that owning a pet can be beneficial for a person's health. We'll be asking my mom how she feels about that statement. Um, I, I would agree with that. Um, I think that Bradley is a very, um, while he's a silly cat, we love being with him. And I think after coming home from a long day, whether like you've been at school, or I've been at work, your dad. Um, it's nice to come home and just hug somebody cuddly. Bradley has been a great part of our lives and our family.